Hello everybody. I was just curious. I just whacked my finger chopping wood because I got a whole bunch of wood. I thought I'd just show you real quick. See all that wood? Yeah. How you doing? Welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. I'm the emperor of my universe. And the boo-boo, yeah, <laughs> like it just ripped it. Big chunk of skin. I'm just like ripping it off. It hurts. I mean, I'm not saying it doesn't, but um, we just it just must be a guy thing because we're built to be the you know the the protectors and one that puts themselves between the danger and everybody else in the village that kind of thing so so maybe we have like a more tolerant for pain that kind of thing but then when we get burst so damn it's a tough one but just maybe it's just a human thing you know what I mean for certain people can because I know pain I understand it for me <clears throat> and a lot of time it is like the mind over matter thing because I look at, I see, I feel pain, I know what it is. It's my nerve receptives, you know, basically let me know that I have a wound. And the, the severity of the wound gives it the intensity of the, the receptives. You know what I mean? They alert. So if you understand that's what it is, it's easier to block it that way. And that's kind of how I look at it. So I don't think that's what this video is about. I'm like, doo -doo -doo, I'm just talking about random shit, but. It's raining, so I have to shut the door. It's going to be raining the next couple days. <coughs> Excuse me. So, a week. I don't know. It's the coast. It says the next 10 days it's going to be raining. So, uh, that's why I was really excited about yesterday getting my, my art out and selling. And I sold one of my paintings. The one I did in Montana that was basically crayon and acrylic. And to a little kid, young boy, it was like maybe nine. It was funny because I'm sitting there and he comes running. This is like at the end of the day. And this was after I went for a walk and tried to fly my kite, which didn't really fly because it wasn't windy enough. And I came back and I was like, well, I'm still, I'm not, if I'm hanging out, just throw out your art, right? So I said, what the hell? So I threw out my art again for a little bit. And this kid runs up and he's like, and I saw he had money in his hand. I'm like, he's like, is your art for sale? I'm like, yeah. I was like, uh, you just leave up. 40 bucks he's like oh i'm like uh oh i was like why so how much you got he goes i got 20 bucks i'm like which one did you want he goes that one i'm like oh man it's like it's yours kid he was like oh, yay so i was like it was cute i got 20 bucks and he got a pain that he was digging just out of nowhere right it was cute he was like and then i told him that it was crayon and he was like really wow so yeah it was cool I mean, not really ideal as far as pricing, is, but you know, it's hard when people love, they're like, I really love that painting. And people are willing to give you, these aren't, I don't have, I've yet, barely, I might have sold maybe one painting or two paintings to people with money. Most of the people that I sell my paintings to are, are workers. They're just, you know, people do, who work in the industries or whatever. They're not rich but they love my art and they're willing to sh shovel their own personal money out. This kid, you know, I was like, do your parents know you're buying this? Thing? He's like, yeah. I'm like, okay, cool. You know, rock on. Thank you. You know, that kind of thing. And I actually got, and, I, and some cute old lady comes pulling up and she's like, like, you know, I'm like, okay, maybe she just can't get out of her car. She wants to buy one of my paintings. She's like, here you go. She said, hand me 20 bucks. I'm like, are you I was like, you're giving me this? Do you want a painting? I was like, I can get I was like, she's so adorable, right? She's like, no. She's like, no. A smile's enough. I'm like, okay, you're adorable. Right? And then I ran into Sonny, Saint Sonny, and he pulled up and he was talking to me. He's like, you know, he's like, you need 20 bucks? I was like, yeah, I always need 20 bucks, right? So he gave me 20 bucks. Yeah, I was like, you sure you can? He's like, yeah, I got it. And he's like, you helped me out last time because I gave him 40 bucks before I took off last time when I left. And so he was cool. He gave me 20 bucks. So I had some money. I had like 60 bucks. I was like, yes. So I bought firewood because I need it because it's going to be rain. Like I said, it's going to be next couple of days, it's going to be cold and rainy. So what I do is when it gets really nasty, as soon as it clears up, I'll light a fire and it warms up the cab and it dries up the cab a little bit. Kinda, plus, I just like make fire. I'm Aries in the bedding, so I, I take advantage of that. But anyway. So yeah, yesterday was a good day. Last three days, <clears throat> excuse me, have been amazing. I had fun. I sold. I was talking to people. I'm getting out. And one of my guys was telling me the blessings come when you get out into the 
people and you mingle and you you know you make connections you you I'm poking the web I mean you know what I mean the if if we are all connected like some spider web I'm bing. so you know I'm talking to people it's so it's really positive these two really adorable young ladies this family were you know and their their daddy was African and their mother was white and they were absolutely beautiful and I'm gonna tell you mixed race babies are usually really smart really beautiful very healthy so all good reasons why we're all just one and it's just variations but anyway it was adorable they both came up and they're like oh, the and they both asked me the same question the first one's like did you paint those i was like yes ma'am and then the other one's like did you paint those i was like yes ma'am and the other one's like you should be an art teacher my art teacher likes that kind of paintings and i was like oh my god it's so cute and i was like thank you very much i'll think about that and the family came back down with the stroller and stuff and I think it was grandma was like, are they giving you a bad time? I'm like, no, they were being very generous, actually, which was adorable. And like, I'm meeting all kinds of people. Everybody's really sweet and wonderful. And my art's getting lots of positive, you know. I mean, like I said, if people are willing to buy, I've sold seven paintings in the last three days, which is like, I'm the victim of my success is now I gotta paint some more. So I bought some more canvas and I covered five backgrounds. I'm excited about that. So now I just have to do the foregrounds. They all turned out really good. I'm really excited. So, yeah. And so, yeah. Life is okay. It's not bad. Could be worse. You know, blessed to have food and I almost have a full tank, which is awesome. So, enough about me. But yeah. Do what you gotta do, people. I mean, <laughs> that's all I can say is survival is important and, and being happy is is paramount and I'm in my vehicle and that like that one lady that, that I met a couple little like three or four days ago who was just like sorry about your predicament and I'm like ma'am I am free I wake up when I want to I go to sleep when I want to I go where I want to I don't have to talk to anybody all day if I don't want to it's that beautiful right but at the same time I like talking to people I like selling my art for a living forces me to interact with other human beings. Otherwise, I would not do it. I would, I'm like, I'm an introvert. I'd huddled in my apartment for like five years, barely contacting friends or anybody. Five years. So obviously I'm, I'm, I mean, I could be an astronaut. I'm cool by myself. But at the same time, I really do enjoy interaction, especially when people are digging my art. And that's the interactions I love. But anyway. Ah, ooh, it stopped raining. Cool. I'm gonna open this up. Ta -ta -ta, and we go. It's not gonna be like that all day. This is just a fluke. But anyway, I love. Ooh, shit. I love you. God loves you, and the universe is crazy about you. So I want you to have a wonderful day, and I hope this video helped in some weird way. And yeah, anyway, love you. Goodbye. Okay,